If you are in Portland, Oregon, and you're looking to invest out of state to get a better return on your investment, to stretch your funds further, and to get in at a fraction of the cost, I am here to help you. I am an expert in helping Portland investors invest out of state. That's what my company specializes in. Let's go. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry in the world. Welcome to the show, folks. Today's show is from a man, Melvin. And Melvin, I got another one you're going to love, dude. Turnkey investment, only going to need about 20 k Not going to be able to do anything like this in uh, the Portland area. That's why you task me to find you the best markets in the nation. And this one is it. I think this property's got your name on it. Let's check out the numbers. Man, I hate those other real estate gurus out there. Those real estate gurus that lead you guys to believe fairy tales, lead you guys to believe in magic, lead you guys to think there's going to be genies granting your wishes if you buy their course or their program. Like there's going to be hot girls in bikinis just popping out. That's not the real life of a real estate investor. And here on Holton Wise TV, we give it to you straight. Welcome back, folks. Let's pull up this turnkey house. Now, this house located in Northeast Ohio, y'all. 1015 West 22nd Lorraine, Ohio, 44052. Just dropped it down to 99. They were trying to get well over 100, a couple price drops. Now we're starting to get into the range where it makes sense for investors. Now, I bet most of you out there have never heard of Lorraine, Ohio. You're like, Lorraine, Ohio? The heck is that? I never heard of no Lorraine, Ohio. That's good. That's good. When people Google best cash flow markets in the USA, they usually come across Cleveland. Same market, folks. It's like 30 minutes west. But my opinion, better place to invest right now. Number one, the city of Cleveland itself Small piece of the puzzle in the greater grand scheme of things in the Cleveland market. Where Holton Wise Services, where we do full service property management, maintenance, construction, insurance, where we help investors buy, we have a population of like four to five million people. The city of Cleveland itself, which gets all the national press, only has about 340,000 people, okay? So it's a very small piece of the puzzle. And that city is going through some issues right now. They just enacted brand new lead paint certification laws, okay? It's a very confusing, convoluted process, and the city is just getting it rolling. Does this change how you invest? Oh, you bet you it does. I did a half-hour video on that topic. I'm going to link it below, okay? Does that mean... Cleveland as a city is a bad investment? No, but right now there's a lot of things you need to know about and there's a lot of turmoil. So I'm taking a wait and see approach and I'm advising a lot of my clients to do the same. Reasons all explained why in that video below, right? So we have an easier to deal with government in Lorraine, which is about a half hour west of Cleveland. In addition, we have better pricing because it doesn't get all the press that the city of Cleveland does. Nobody's heard of it, right? There's no Lorraine Cavs, no Lorraine Browns, no Lorraine Indians, or Lorraine Guardians if you're woke. And you can pick up properties like this little guy, man. Look at this thing. Totally renovated to the nines, man. This is perfect blue-collar living, dude. It's fresh. It's clean, it's crisp, and it is friggin' cheap. Dude, your tenants are going to love this thing, right? Fresh, clean, safe housing, man. That's what they want. They even get a little hangout area in the basement, right? That's rare in these neighborhoods, right? Big ticket item right here. Brand new furnace, man. These things cost about three Gs, last about 30 years. You ain't got to worry about it, okay? They're asking 99. I am going to want to have you bid 90. Then what we're going to do, get a Section 8 or cash-paying tenant, about 11 and a quarter. Yeah, 11 and a quarter for this teeny tiny little house that's going to cost you like 20-something Gs out of your pocket, right? 11 and a quarter. Factor in your fixed and variable expense estimates with my team handling the management. You're looking at approximately 7371 in a pure NOI. That's factoring in capital expenditures, but all the stuff on this is new, right? New. Furnace, new hot water tank. The roof is new-ish, right? So we're looking good, right? So a lot of that is money you're probably going to be getting on top of this for a very long time. But no, eventually you need to replace these, right? Like eventually you'll need to do that furnace again, right? But pure cash flow estimates, 
about 7300 a year on average. Now, if you could pick it up at 90, you only put down 22 and a half. Bank kicks in the other 67 and a half. That projects out to an 18% cash on cash return. In addition, Lorraine, two new naval bases being built right over there. That's going to add several thousand jobs. You know what happens to housing demand when you add several thousand jobs? Boop! Yeah, it goes up, folks. Safe, solid, C ish grade neighborhood. Have your pick of Section 8 or regular pay tenants. We manage a ton of properties over there. And in my opinion, this is the emerging market in the Cleveland market right now. Definitely smart to take a wait and see approach due to those lead laws in the city of Cleveland. Lorraine government, so much easier to deal with. So much more landlord friendly at the moment. No turmoil, right? This deal, this is a solid investment. Let me know what you want to do. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.